ki khubor ka batisi tv lawan ra shapi da ka orange nissan loom so pho near fire brigade shillong admissions are open at bdw international school enroll now Menteri Rang Bajong Kejela Ukonrat Konggal Sangma Hakekat Sao Terik Ubenai Rempang Arazar Arpu Ar Bila pelipat baik ke Kleriat Civil Hospital Kebadan Cispa Ateli ke Jingtia Ha kebala Saki Lang Duk Menteri Ketenat Social Welfare Ubah Akerman Shela Ubah Dairu UMLA Jongka Kleriat Constituency Lembat ke MDC Jongka Jaintia Hills Autonomous District Council U Deputy Commissioner Jongka East Jaintia Hills U Abilaj Baranwal ke Commissioner and Secretary Jong Katnat ke Koit ke Khia ke Kong MN Nampui u Director Katnat Health and Services MI u Dr Amanwar u District Medical and Health Officer Jong ke East Jentia Hills District u Dr D Shilla ki Doctor ki Nurse ke Clearyat Civil Hospital bat ki Wei ki Wei ki Head Officer Jong Katnat ke Koit ke Khia kene ke Hospital Kalayo Jingera Bru na ke Round Table India Shillong Round Table Trust Kabala ay ang COVID ward ha kibnay baka jingpang klam COVID-19 kala rin siya ting e ay kapartay baro kaway bat siklor tam kapisa na kabenta bantit ay kijingtia bat kiway kiway di kitiar sumar ay kinong pang. As was witnessed all over the country in the recent years, especially during the onslaught of the COVID-19 pandemic, health centers can come under a lot of stress and strain. This makes the strengthening of health systems the dire need of the hour. In these circumstances, the government of Meghalaya, under the able leadership of the Honorable Chief Minister, has been able to steer the states towards a steady path by continuously striving to improve the health infrastructure. So therefore, it is another very important step towards providing better health care to the general masses of our state. Something we can't see or we can't assess or we are not aware of then obviously the anxiety goes up and therefore uh, to fight against an enemy like that had been a great challenge and without your commitment and support i don't think that we as a state would have been able to face and uh, overcome the challenges of covid 19 the health services throughout the country and also in our state uh, is very challenging and uh, we have realized this more so during covid times where we realize that basic services which need to be provided at the grassroots level were not there and as was mentioned by dr amanwar that the mda government has given unprecedented importance to the health services be it manpower deployment be it medication be it overall infrastructure development in all areas we have tried our best to ensure that we give more importance to health services in the last two years through many schemes including the state government schemes including the world bank scheme of about 300 crores different sub centers phc chcs have been upgraded and many more in terms of infrastructure that is and many more will be upgraded as we move along through similar funding that is given by world bank as well as by the state government that there are many services that we can give in existing sub centers and phcs and chcs without having to invest too much and therefore we as a government have been working to ensure that we are able to provide more services at the grassroots level more facilities to our people by simply improving the basic infrastructures and sub centers by ensuring that we are able to train the manpower at the grassroots level to be able to do a bit more and we realize that uh, 60 to 70% of the primary care that we need to give to our people can be done at the sub center at the phc level and the secondary and tertiary services and the care we need to give need not be there in all the areas of course we need it but we realize the constraint of resources so therefore keeping in mind the resources we have 
if we can focus on these primary health service, uh, services and the care, then we will be able to cater to most of the requirement of our people. And that is the kind of strategy that we're trying to follow by ensuring that we focus on these primary care services that are required at the grassroots level. And therefore, basic things like hygiene, basic things like uh, nutrition, basic things uh, like ensuring that uh, we're able to take care of ourselves at the grassroots level. So preventive, ensuring that we exercise, we ensuring that we eat the right food, ensuring that uh, practices so that uh, lifestyle diseases that we have, like uh, blood pressure and, uh, um, and um, high sugar and other such uh, lifestyle diseases can be prevented. So it's very important for us to take care of that. And uh, Meghalaya has gone for a very comprehensive health policy to focus on these areas. <laughs> This is the living room. Yeah, I know. Come on. Come on.